Okay, I wanna go over a few more details on this Chromebook and using it with an online slicer called Kirimoto for our Tina 2 printer. This is a WeDo printer. Notice that I'm looking under preview for my slicer online using a Chromebook and I'm seeing that the nozzle temperature is preset to 200. I did not see that initially and didn't realize that that temperature is lower than what I want. I would want to change that to 215. I believe that is a better temperature because I believe I've had some faulty prints because my um, nozzle has been too cool. Also, I found an extender for my spool holder right here. It's under WeFun, not WeDo, but it still works. Tina 2 large spool arm for my printer for larger spools. It's a two-part item and it um, has holes that match the standard spool holder. So I printed a larger, longer spool holder for larger spools and the hole alignment matches the holes in the case of the Tina 2. So that's working well. We're printing some large gears that go that have the plus hole on the forward and axle for our Lego robotics using the various power boards that are available and, and motors. So this is working. It's printing for us well using the Kirimoto that comes under grid space Kiri and you choose your um, machine right here under setups and machine and then you can choose which profile you want which machine there are many and Tina 2 has been added Tina 2 basic has now been added so we can use a Chromebook to do our slicing. There'll be more.